Talk about sort of building this value-driven company. Yeah, I, it comes from my personal experience. I'm, I'm a farmer. Someone mm -hmm. grew up in the eastern part of Turkey, sheep herding, farming, yogurt making, cheese making. Mm -hmm. I was far away from the world of business. In a way, in an emotional way, I really didn't like the people in business or CEOs because I thought, you know, they're the one who's doing the, all the bad things and we're the one who's suffering. Mm -hmm. um, coming to U.S., being upstate, starting this whole thing, all my goal was how do I not become someone I used to hate before, mm -hmm. you know, growing up? And is there a way that you can exercise all these business practices without being that? Um, so I've never been an activist, even though I was very passionate about act, you know, certain, certain things, but I believe on doing things mm -hmm. and let those things to speak by itself. Mm -hmm. uh, we've been quiet for six, seven years until this immigration and refugee issue came up. And, and we opened our doors and we said, come and look. We have 30% of our company's populations are immigrants and refugees. Mm -hmm. There's 19 different nationalities in 20 different languages spoken in our plants. These are all human beings. All just want to do is build life. Mm -hmm. And it's, it was a community work before it was anything else as, a, as an um, active you know, opinion making in here. And that was an eye opening for, for a lot of people and people thought could it took, and that issue took it in so many different directions. Ray Park came out and said stuff, and others said some stuff. I got some bad letters and good letters and all that kind of stuff. But in the end, it's been three, four, five years of practice mm -hmm. in our community in upstate New York and Idaho. And the experience speaks by itself on any political statement that you can make, that these are terrorists, or these are here to take your job, or these are here to destroy your community, or this. Any of the communication you can make, I have live experience that I can show that mm -hmm. these are all human beings that just want to do is they've done through, they've gone through massive life experience, saved their lives, came here. All we have to do in a business is give them an opportunity and mm -hmm. let them be part of the community.